Hey all, today I'm going to show you the results of a controller input latency test I performed comparing the Xbox Series X and PC versions of Halo Infinite Multiplayer. In a prior video, I compared the controller input latency on the Xbox Series X and PC for Apex Legends. Here were the results. As you can see, there's a large difference in the input lag between the Series X and PC versions of Apex, which I hope is fixed in the upcoming next-gen update. I was curious to see if there was a similar difference in input lag between the PC and Xbox Series X versions of Halo. I described the methodology of my input latency test in the description of the video for those who want to replicate my test. So here are the results of the test for Halo comparing the Series X to PC. Unlike with Apex Legends, the input latency of the Series X and PC versions of Halo are about the same at around 40 milliseconds. Before I started the test, I assumed the PC version would have lower latency, but this isn't the case. I believe the input latency of Halo is higher than that of Apex on PC, 41 milliseconds versus 21, because Apex on PC has special low input latency support for NVIDIA graphics cards, which is called NVIDIA Reflex. I think my methodology is good on consumer-grade equipment, which is important because we want more consumers to perform this test and try to get game developers to reduce the input lag in video games. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe.